Okay, we have the heart. Here's all the major um, exterior landmarks. We have the aorta, the pulmonary arteries, um, the superior vena cava, and then the inferior vena cava right there. Um, so, beginning, oh, and also the auricles here, which will be just the superficial parts of both the right and the left atriums. Okay, so all the blood from the body, which is oxygen depleted, will come in from the superior and inferior vena cava into the right atrium, uh, which will then go through the tricuspid valve into the right ventricle, okay? Then the vi right ventricle will discharge through the pulmonary valve, through the pulmonary arteries into the, the lungs, okay? The lungs will replenish the oxygen in the red blood cells and the returning blood will come in through the pulmonary veins, these two sets right here, and also on the back right there, okay? Into the left atrium. So the left atrium is gonna collect the oxygen-rich blood from the, the lungs, ready to go. It'll push it down through the bicuspid valve into the left ventricle. You can see the left ventricle is always gonna be a little meatier because it's gotta send out the blood all throughout the body. This is the, um, what's it called, intraventricular septum. This is what's going to separate the left ventricle from the right ventricle, okay? And then this blood is ready to go out through the, the body, so it's going to discharge through the aortic um, valve, through the big aorta, and then, uh, you know, disperse systemically through the whole body. Um, as far as the veins go... Um, we have the great venous cavity in the back. Um, we have the right uh, coronary artery on this side. And then we have, I think, a left one on the front as well. And yeah, that's pretty much all there is to know.